Hi, hello and welcome, Microbe Hunter here. Today we'll be doing a totally meaningless, pointless and irrelevant microscopy project, but one which is extremely fun. I spend hours uh, behind uh, my stereo microscope, uh, that's the one that I'll be using today, and I've been observing, yes, <laughs> a fountain pen, okay? Uh, there is ink in here and this ink uh, is uh, soaked up by various uh, types of paper. So I got some tissue paper here, um, toilet paper, uh, writing paper, newspaper, all different types of paper. And what I did is the following. Um, yeah, I, I used this pen to write on these uh, different types of paper and I looked uh, under the microscope uh, and this looked pretty cool. So let's get started. Yeah, so um, as I just uh, told you, um, I used different types of paper and what we did is the following, or what I did is the following, um, I observed capillary action. So uh, there are very uh, small microscopic fibers in paper like this. And, and what they do is, is of course, they soak up uh, water and because the ink is water-based, um, it also soaks up the ink. And you can actually see how the ink spreads along the fibers. Um, so uh, what I'll do is let's just roll the music and you can enjoy pen and paper. So this is my fountain pen under 20 times magnification and uh, using regular writing paper and you can see that the paper is relatively slow in absorbing the ink um, but this also means that the lines are relatively clearly defined and that's supposed to be a smiley face it does look a little bit creepy after admit so I'll try it again that's my smiley here okay and a little bit of time lapse so that we do not have to wait too long. And uh, now this is a uh, newspaper and you can see that the ink is absorbed much more. Um, it flows uh, uh, apart a little bit and you can see that the individual fibers um, are also a little bit more visible and uh, the ink uh, flows along these fibers. This is now at 40 times magnification. And I'm also using some tissue paper. You can see the texture of the tissue paper and it is highly absorbent. Newspaper again. Toilet paper, also very absorbent. And again, tissue paper. It's a little bit difficult uh, to write uh, that precisely uh, under the microscope. So I had to hold the piece of paper very tightly. And also the tissue paper fibers are very nicely visible now. Toilet paper has several layers, and now I took one single layer. One of the really nice things is, is I also have here a correction pen, um, and there, this uh, correction pen is able to do a chemical reaction um, on uh, with the ink, uh, and therefore it's able to yeah remove uh, the ink uh, again, and also this uh, looks pretty nice. Yeah, and as you can see, this uh, correcting pen is uh, quite effective and right now I'm simply undoing all of the little artworks uh, that I have done during the past uh, half an hour or so. And uh, just uh, like the ink it itself, uh, the correcting fluid uh, flows um, along uh, the paper fibers and spreads. And I uh, remember when I was a child, uh, we used to write secret messages like this. We simply have uh, written letters uh, on paper using the correcting fluid first. Yeah. 
Yeah, and you can see the ink slowly disappearing. Yeah, and uh, it's quite nice uh, to see how this uh, correcting fluid also spreads along the fibers and slowly starts uh, to remove the ink. A little bit of time lapse again, so that we do not have to wait too long. And this also looks quite nice. Now the real question, however, is an entirely different one. The real question is, 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 uh, is it art? Okay, is this art? Well, um, I think that the blue spot, well, actually it's in black, white. Uh, maybe I should print this out in color and it's the wrong way around, I think. Well, now, now, now it's art, now it's art. Okay, um, I, I, wish you, I wish you all the best and, and happy micro hunting. And don't forget, like and subscribe. Bye-bye.